Climate meteorologist Joe Charlevoix, another frigid start to the work week in what has been an abnormally cold winter so far here across northern Michigan. Some say, well, this is how it used to be. Well, the numbers bear it out. This is actually quite a bit below normal uh, so far. But uh, here's what we're looking at. We do have some snow, lake effect snow on our Monday. The th fact of the matter is, though, on the Great Lakes, we have a growing ice cover uh, the most this early in the season since 1994. So whenever you get ice, you can't get lake effect snow because the water can't evaporate through the ice. So we're noticing, uh, and plus with such a small or such a cold air mass, a very small snowflake size, so it's not accumulating as much as it could. But there will be some lake effect snow Monday at times, another inch or two possible. Quiet Tuesday, a few flurries, light lake effect snow showers. Highs Tuesday only around 5 above. And then Wednesday actually looks pretty good. We get back into the teens on Wednesday with lots of sunshine the first half of the day late. And this is most likely after sunset. We will see a little bit of uh, cloud cover returning. But winds are the big story. They are making our wind chills feel more like, in some spots, 20, 30 to 40 below zero. And you can see our winds, as we forecast this out into our Monday, turning westerly. And then they will go more southwesterly on Tuesday. But our wind speed remains pretty sustained. Uh, so we have, again, very gusty winds on our Tuesday. This is Tuesday night around 930. And then on Wednesday, winds will actually turn a little more southerly. But again, pretty gusty, keeping it pretty chilly when you factor the wind and the air temperature together. And look at our actual daytime highs that you'll read on your thermometer. Across the lake, staying below zero. Northern Michigan in the single digits today. And then for your Monday night, we Drop back pretty much area-wide below zero. Look at the numbers here to the west, 25 below at Green Bay, so very frigid. And when you factor that wind that we showed you and the temperature together, this is a forecast of wind chill around 4 o'clock this afternoon. Wind chills will be in the 25 to 40 below range around northern Michigan. Again, this is what it will feel like across the area uh, later today. So, again, very frigid. Snow amounts are not looking at anything exceptional, but we may see an inch or two. On uh, spots, whatever snow does come down will continue to blow around with the wind, so it'll seem a little bit worse with some blowing and drifting. And there is our seven-day forecast. The two coldest days today and tomorrow, Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday, the sun returns. It'll just be nice to see the sunshine Wednesday. We get a little break from the cloud cover. Thursday, another clipper dives in that will bring some light snow to the area. Highs, though, will be in the 20s just ahead of that disturbance. And then quiet. We could see some flurries. It's certainly possible Friday into next weekend. And, of course, uh, next Sunday, Groundhog Day, a high then around 19.